Good morning, happy Monday. to work for my last day of the week and I'm off the next two days always a good time of the week and it's so weird now because it's still kind of dark out because this whole daylight savings time is just like still kind of dark people got their headlights on and usually it's pretty bright did I say that yesterday I think I did I'm saying it again it's just dark at this time of morning now I'm trying to get caught up from this whole daylight savings time because it puts everybody behind a little bit. The only thing, I love daylight savings because it stays lighter later, but the only problem is that it feels like you have more time. Like, it's 8 o'clock and it only feels like 7 o'clock. It's like, oh my god, it's already 8 o'clock? Or like, oh, I have all this time. I'm like, holy cow, it's 9 o'clock. I gotta get ready to get to bed and all that stuff. It just doesn't feel like it's that late because it's brighter out, so you feel like it's not that late. That time sneaks up on you and it's already, you know, like 8, 9 o'clock. So that takes a little adjusting getting used to that. So, anyway, I'm headed to work. Brad's off today. He was still sleeping when I left. He was tired because of his uh, trip. So it's going to take him a while to get caught up from all this busy stuff he did for the weekend. So anyway, headed to work and I will uh, see you guys after work. Oh my gosh, this morning, Monday morning traffic is terrible. I'm never gonna get to work. I guess everybody decided to go to work today. It's crazy. I'm not even moving right now. Good Monday morning, y'all. Just got the kids to school. Well, the two oldest. I'm taking the two youngest to daycare. And then I'm going to go get my sister, Christy. And she's going to go do some running with me and stuff today. Excuse me. So, anyways... Just thought I'd check in this morning and say good morning to everybody. So, oh, shoot. I kind of overslept today, so. And then tomorrow, hopefully, maybe after I get the kids to school and stuff, we can take my van and to get some brakes put on it because they are grinding. So hopefully we can get that done tomorrow and we'll just take Brett's truck do, to do all of our running that we need to do. So, so for now I'm going to be out for a little while and then I'll go pick up my sister and all that. Out of town. I was out of town and Ralphie is so happy that I'm back and so is Mackenzie. They have been loving on me since they got up this morning such a good feeling to be a parent and have your kids loving on you because they missed you because you were out of town I'm not, I didn't so. miss you because you were there last night I was there yeah yeah you didn't miss me last night but you missed me while I was out of town no I, was, I missed you when you were home you missed me when you were when I was home yeah not when I was gone Oh, so you don't miss me then when I'm gone. Yeah, I miss you when you... I miss you when you go to work. You do? Yeah. I miss you when I go to work too. Is he not full of caca or what? I'm... Uh, 
Alrighty, well, I'm gonna go out right now and then I will talk to you guys later. Well, my sister and I have been doing running around together today. We're about to go get Mackenzie because my life's about to be hell. I gotta have Mackenzie at a therapist appointment at 2.30. And then the caseworker is going to meet me there, and then he's going to take her back to daycare when therapy's done. And I will be going to get Marco after that, and I have to take him, excuse me, to go get his temporary filling out and the medicine they put in his tooth and get a uh, real filling in then and then I gotta call and make an appointment for him to get a cap on his tooth so after that then I gotta get home I gotta get help with homework and then I gotta get the kids back to get the kids fed a bath and then you know all that good stuff uh oh sorry a notification came up on my phone reminded me of all this so that's good. It works. So anyways, I'm here to pick up Mackenzie now from school so I can take my sister to the bank and stuff and then back home and um, then get, oh, excuse me, Mackenzie to therapy. So we'll talk to you later. I'm on my way to take Kenzie to therapy. I kind of changed plans around today. And um, so I rescheduled Marco's appointment because I would have to get Natalie picked up from school. I just wish her and Marco could get along enough where she could go home for a few minutes by herself with Marco, but that won't work so I just changed his appointment and uh, that way I can get Mackenzie to therapy and then be back in time to get Natalie from school and um, then we'll pick up Marco and go get Ralphie so change things around but that's what you got to do sometimes there's just not enough people to get all these kids everywhere they need to be so with that being said at least it's not gonna be as crazy but I still have to rush back to get Natalie from school and um, then we can get started on homework and stuff a little sooner, so that's good. Because it's nice out, and the kids are going to want to go outside and play. It's like 62 degrees, so they can go outside and play. So, I will get out of here, and I will check in later. TGIM, once again, it's Monday. I'm off work for my weekend and I'm headed to get Ralphie because Brad has all the other kids he had to take Mackenzie to, to therapy and I so he got her out of daycare early to take her to therapy and he had to cancel Marco's uh, uh, dentist appointment because he couldn't go because he didn't have anybody to pick up Natalie so kind of hard to do it all by yourself so we try to make all the appointments on Tuesdays and Wednesdays because we're well I'm off those days so it's easier because I can help him out and he's off Tuesday and then uh, most of Wednesday he gets off the one. so I'm gonna pick up Ralphie and head home and I'm going to try to make this an early night I want to get dinner done. Hopefully Brad's got most of the homework done and we can get, we're just having leftovers because mom made all that 
Thanksgiving dinner last night, so we got lots of leftovers for enough dinner tonight. Get that dinner done, get past done, finish any homework that has to be done, and so they can get to bed on time and we can be done early. So maybe I can get to bed earlier tonight. Because I'm off tomorrow, but I have to get up and get the kids to school. So I don't want to be tired from staying up too late. So I am on my way to get Ralphie and I will uh, check in with you guys later. Hopefully you had a good day. It's nice out today too. A little cloudy, but it's nice. It's not quite as warm as it was. I'd say it's about 60, I think it's 60, lower 60s. Still nice though. Got my window now. Taking in some of that cool pre-spring air. Okay, we're calling it a night tonight. About the end of the night. Didn't vlog a whole bunch today because we kind of just chilled at home. <laughs> had a busy weekend, so we just kind of had dinner and got the kids to uh, bed. And then we came to bed. I didn't vlog a lot tonight. I just wanted to be with the kids and Brett since I've been gone for the weekend. So I didn't vlog a whole lot. Want to spend my time with them because I haven't seen them for two days. So, good night, y'all. Got a busy day tomorrow. We have to do all our stuff because we go to California a week from tomorrow. Woo! -hoo! Can't wait. It's going to suck being away from the kids, though. And we're not going to be able to talk to Natalie and Mackenzie on FaceTime because they're going to be with their siblings. And I don't believe that they have iPhones. I believe they have Samsungs. So we won't be able to FaceTime them. But I will be calling to talk to them. But we'll get to FaceTime Marco and Ralphie. Because my niece has an iPhone. And so does my brother-in-law. So I'll be able to FaceTime them. So we can talk to them. So good night, y'all. All right, good night.